Alright, so, my very first 3DS stream and my very first 3DS, uh, capturing here. I think what we're gonna do is the first thing we'll do is check out the game that's actually plugged in. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, The Legend of Zelda A Link Between Worlds. So this is a game that I played back in December when it came out, December of 2013. I played it on and off over the course of the year, but really haven't had a lot of time to dedicate to it, okay? So, let's jump in and let's actually see how the game looks with my 3DS capture. I'm excited. Also, I'm excited because I have huge screens now on this 3DS XL. I used to play on the little regular 3DS. They were tiny. Oh, shit! That was pretty excellent right there. <laughs> that was pretty excellent. All right, so let's jump in and see what it looks like. People are saying the game sound is loud. Oh, well, someone, one person, two people did. I can adjust it. Hold on. Let's, uh... Let's get the game booted. So as you can see, I'm in the dark world currently. I'm at my house in the dark world. The game looks amazing. On this 3DS XL, it looks amazing. I don't know how it looks for you guys on the stream, but for me, it looks pretty freaking sweet. So... Some people are saying it's not loud. It's, I don't know what you're talking about. Audio is fine. Most people are saying audio is fine. Okay. Let's mess around a little bit here. Pick up. I'm trying to remember what the controls are. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I just threw a flaming fireball. Where's this guy's ass? I almost had the, the freaking... The flame scepter out. So what you can see here on the top is you know, what I'm seeing on the screen. And the bottom is actually the mini-map. And those X's on the mini-map are where people were, uh, are, were kidnapped. It looks like the wizards or whatever who need to be saved. Similar to how in the original Legend of Zelda Link to the Past you had to save the, the princesses or whatever that were kidnapped. And this one, oh fuck, I burned myself. <laughs> and this one, it's the wizards. These are some of the traditional enemies from Link to the Past. Pretty neat. Some people are saying the game is too loud and others are saying it's fine, so I don't even know what to what to to believe. Huh. I could lower the game volume a little bit if you guys would like. You could try that. Alright, here I'll pause the game. Hold on. It's just gonna take me to have to get up and do it. But like I said, it's on the other monitor. Alright, everyone's saying it's a bit loud, so I am gonna adjust it. Hold on, everybody. Hold on. Okay, let's see how it sounds now. I just put it down to a little bit under 50% volume, so let's see if this is a little better. Here we go, ready? Alright, so now I've adjusted it. You guys let me know what it sounds like. Does it sound good? Please let me know. As I run around here and just dick around a little bit. I don't remember how to run. Oh, I don't have the dash boots yet, so I can't run yet. Way better. Good. Perfect. People are saying, now it's perfect. Good. Now, of course, now people are saying, now it's way too quiet. Well, you can't have it both ways. You can't have it both ways, ladies and gentlemen. This is the castle. I don't think we can get in here yet. Not until we save all the dudes. Ah, oh, shit! hundred guys here! Look at this thing! It's fucking Satan's sphincter! <laughs> Look at that! Here, have this. I fucking missed! Ah! Pretty crazy. 
Alright, so you a safe spot, right? Oh, I unlocked a new safe spot. Boop, boop, boop. New weather vane has been added to the map. Sure, save, why not? Alright. So I am streaming at 30 frames per second. I could push it, and I could attempt to actually stream at 60 frames per second. But well, only people watching on the stream would see it. On YouTube, you can't even broadcast or uh, record it or play at that yet. Uh, the game does run at 60 frames per second now, so it kind of is what it is for now. You're kind of stuck. People are saying try out a dungeon. I have to actually find a dungeon I can go into. I don't know what dungeons I can go into here. Actually, what items do I have? Hold on. I have two fairies in a bottle. Look at this. I have arrows. I got a ton of stuff. Ice, the ice rod. I equip this. That's not how you do it. You gotta press X, I think. X or Y. There we go. So in this game, it's a little different from A Link to the Past. In this game, your magic power regenerates. So watch this. See that? So I freeze. But you see that it's a little meter on the bottom left-hand corner of the screen? It actually regenerates. So you don't need to worry about running out of magic power in this game because you're going to get it back no matter what. Let's see what's down here. Chill out. Stay cool! Oh, you fuck! Great, I'm gonna hear the stupid beeping, because I got hit. I need a heart. Fuck. I need a goddamn heart! I died! Well, I got fairies. That's what the fairies are for. That's what fairies are for. Wow, the ice rod sucks. The fire rod was way better. Go back to the fire rod. There we go. So it says I'm near a dungeon. Near the bog of bullshit. That's where we are. The bog of bullshit. Oh god, look at this. What the hell? I didn't even know I could do that. Shit. Fuck you. We got a freaking sp a spear thrower. God damn it, I keep getting hit. Damn. That was not strong enough to blow it up. Nope. Okay. Music is amazing. Remix version of the original theme from uh, Link to the Past. I love it. Da, 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 da. Looks like I need to jump in somehow? Oh, I can't get to this one yet. Look, I need to be able to break this rock and I can't. Huh. The motherfucker keeps hitting me. Well, I cannot get into this dungeon. Not right now. What's this? A monster tail. It's a bit smelly. Ugh. What do we got here? I can swim. I got Zora's slippers. Looks like there would be something there, but there's not. It's this thing. Oh shit! It's a warp. A warp to the other side. There's two worlds, the light world and the dark world. This is how you get through them. Now we got the classic Legend of Zelda theme. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, what the hell? The dude was hiding in the grass? You motherfucker. Oh, dude was in the tall grass. Alright, we're gonna go back. We're gonna be in the dark world. Dun, 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 dun. I love this theme. I don't think I can lift this big rock yet. 
shit, so I can't get to the dungeon to the left either. See, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going right now. I don't know what, what order you're supposed to do the dungeons. This guy's got a shield. Yeah? Fuck your shield. Your shield block a giant flaming column, asshole? <laughs> Guess not. Suck on that. I don't want to die. What the hell's this? I don't even know what that was. Boy, hidden area. Oh shit, what the hell's this? Us brothers will be taking this here treasure, lest you be dashing, you may as well go home now. Oh, I don't have the da I don't have the dash ability, so I can't do this yet. I would love to play this game as a playthrough. Seriously. This game's amazing. Oh, I got the Master Sword upgrade. Throws out the freaking wave beam. Oh shit, look out. Son of a bitch! God damn, I can barely hurt these guys. Look how many hits! Look at this! Hit, hit, hit! Motherfucker! That dude took a billion hits! Holy crap! What's up here? Who's this? Let me unlock the save point first. This guy is. Are you really running around with a sword like that? Sheesh. I pour my heart and soul into crafting fine weapons, and folks still just battle with whatever they find lying around. Ha! <laughs> he dissed the master sword. <laughs> he dissed the master sword. You're the kid's boss wife- You're the kid the boss's wife picked up, eh? I don't know where I could do for you, I just work here, you know what I mean? I say work, but you know we're all that busy here. It's not like we're all that busy. Ah, I see. They don't have a lot of work. What do you want this time? Here I am taking all this time just to help folks out. Since when did I get so nice? What a bitch. I think she's the one that saves you when you get warped to the dark world. Huh. I motherfucker, god damn, he takes so many hits. He gives me one heart. A thousand hits, one heart. Oh, shit, what's in here? Ah! I don't mean to boast about my spicy darling here, but why not? I like everyone's got a fellow like him. He's handsome and talented. Oh, come on, Mapes. I know how I can't. You know how I can't stand compliments. Unless you say them right. I'm the most handsome and talented. Why, I'm the foremost fortune teller this world in or any other. Of course you are, darling, and I'm most fortunate to witch around. Don't you dare nitpick my darling's fortunes. He's always right. I'm a reader of fortunes, and I see your future. I'll tell you what's to come for 20 rupees. Higgledy, piggledy, porkity, florkity, moppity, sloppity, kerplop. Oh, so much fortune to tell. It's like a buffet of fate. I see seven paths before you. Which path would you like to ask about? Oh, look at this. The Skull Woods. Oh, a sign from on high. I see it. Alright, I'll state it plainly. I can see Sahazrila's house in Kakariko Village. And I see something strange on the wall in the back of the house. I suggest you investigate. That concludes our session. Were you able to see the path he'll take? So there you go. He gave me a hint. He's basically telling me to go back to the light world, to the village, and go to the house that used to be Sahazrila's, and look at the back wall. Huh. Interesting. 20 rupees. Don't pay him. Don't fucking pay him. <laughs> Get the fortune. Don't pay him. Alright, so there's something I actually want to test out. 
before we switch over to another game here, uh, this capture device that I'm using now has the ability to remove the pixely filter that actually runs on 3DS games. So hold on a second, everyone. I'm gonna try something. I want you to tell me if the game looks better, okay? Hold on. I'm gonna pause the game. I'm gonna walk over to my PC again. And we're gonna try this. Because right now, it's basically running the running a filter, you know? It's running a filter over the game. Let's see here. Aha! Uh -huh. No filter. Hmm. So there we go, I removed the filter. I mean, <clears throat> I'll come back. I removed the filter that was running, and I'm curious to see if this looks better or worse. So let's take a look now, okay? Let's take a look. Do you guys think this looks crisper and clearer than it did before, or do you think it looks better with the filter running? I can't really tell because I'm far away from my PC screen, but I'm, it's up to you guys. Let me know if it looks better or not. Looks worse. Some people are saying it looked better with the filter. Looks worse. So the filter actually made the game look clearer. Okay. That's fine. We can re-enable the filter. Yeah, well, everyone's saying it looks worse. Everyone. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go re-enable the filter then. Now we know that the filter basically makes it look better. Alright, hold on. Alright, so there it is, back with the filter. It looks vile, foul, and disgusting. <laughs> Vile, foul, and disgusting. That's a great description. Oh, so now we're in the evil village, huh? The evil side village? I think we are. The fucking chi the evil chicken. This was a milk bar in the light world. Here it's... What is it? A destroyed building? Let's see. What do you want? Scram, brat. What with all the monsters running around, more and more folks are taking refuge in here. Customers everywhere. It really gets my goat. What the hell? <laughs> I just want to drink a bottle of milk in peace. Why can't everyone just leave me alone and scram? I don't have one right now. No, I don't. Oh, wait, I do. Premium milk. Shit. I don't know if I should give this guy the premium milk or not. Hey, I, do I look, think I look strong? Sure. You lying? Because your ears twitch real funny there. Mine do that when I lie. They twitch all the time. Anyway, I may not look it, but I'm regular at the Treacherous Tower. What do you mean you never heard of the Treacherous Tower? Well, you know Death Mountain? It's right on top of that. It's where all the tough guys go for fun. Huh. Who's this guy? Here I am working for the royal family. As if it weren't their fault, things falling apart. Look around, kiddo. It's all thieves and creepy masked folks in this village. There's nothing royal about this place. Huh. She looks lonely. Poor little Kuko Kukos. Their co-op got all smashed up. All that's left is these eggs. Don't worry, little eggies. I'll make sure nothing happens to you. Met the boss of our little village here? <laughs> yeah, he wouldn't like he wouldn't waste time on someone like you. He's busy stashing away that new painting he's got. Thing must be worth a fortune. If that thief girl knows where it is, she best keep her trap shut. Unless she wants to tell me where it is. That whole thing kind of inspired me, anyway. Want to hear my latest ditty? Wrong place, wrong time, and the boss will be glad to put you back in line. A smart thief fears the boss's wrath. I'd rather be on a cliff walking a narrow path. Wow. That was exciting. You 
fucking son of a bitch. I just go into this abandoned house. You gotta throw a ch fucking spear. There's a ghost. Stab that ghost. Bunch of dicks. Oh, how do you get in here and get this money? Wait a minute. Aha! Uh -huh. That's the special ability for this game. Link can merge with walls and walk around them. It's kind of weird. There's a few puzzles in the game that, that require it that are really odd. What the fuck am I looking at? Although we have seen the world crumble before us, we must not give in to the corruption of thievery. Monsters can keep you strong. They are your only salvation, my son. You must don the mask. Don the mask. We are corrupt, corrupt. Do not be deceived. Only monsters will save us now. Mumbo jumbo, mumbo jumbo. This is the follower. Those statues at the north edge of town are entrances to some sort of hideout. It gives me the chills just looking at them. I once knocked on the door, but they told me to make a, take a piece of fruit and scoop. I wish I had the strength to leave this terrible place entirely. Huh. Whoa. There's a warp here. I wonder if this goes anywhere good. Let's see where this leads us. What the hell? E how? How in Hyrule did you get in here? My door is locked, DSP. Well, never mind. I'm actually glad you popped in. I was just admiring my new dress. What do you think of it? Glamorous, isn't it? Oh, you're too kind. Very sweet of you. So here, take this as thanks. A piece of heart. I'll leave the door open so you're welcome to pop in and out as you please. I got a piece of heart for doing that. Not bad. Boy, she's fat. Alright, back to the dark world. Huh. Okay. There's a dungeon. There's no save point in this town? You would think there would be a here we go. There we are. A new weather vane added. Save? Yes. Let's save. Nice. Okay. Very nice. Alright, everyone. So that was a good demo of The Legend of Zelda Link Between Worlds, wasn't it? That was a good opportunity to test it out. I think we're going to switch now. Switch up and do something different. So, uh, that is it for now. Will I do this as a full playthrough in the future? There's a possibility. I'm only, you know, not even halfway through the game here. So, there's a very big possibility that I would just replay the original portions of the game and do a playthrough now that I actually have a capture device. Not going to be anytime soon, considering we're about to enter the hardcore gaming season. But, uh, we are not going to start right away. It'll definitely be, maybe, I mean, hey, let's face it. With all the downtime stuff that happens during the year, this would have been a perfect thing to do. So, it could definitely happen during downtime, right? Alright, so that's it for Zelda. Cool.